Hey, welcome to Is It A Good Idea To Microwave This? I'm your host, Jory Karen. I'm just, you know, making a little pizza over here out of Play-Doh. Just gonna see if I can, uh, um, oh, maybe some uh, pink cheese on this, right? Oh, some big old, oh, wait, no, it's sauce, isn't it? That doesn't even make sense. I don't even know what I'm talking about here. Oh, man. Let's put some, uh, some veggies on this. Oh, and I don't even have a brick oven, so, uh, I guess you're wondering how I'm gonna cook this, right? <laughs> Microwave it! Have a slice. That pizza looks awful. Is it a good idea to microwave this? Let's find out. Here at the Jory Karen Laboratory, safety is our number one concern. And that's why we hide behind this giant tinfoil shield. It's protect our nuts, because what nobody that... What is this pizza? You mean my play dough giorno pizza? Oh, God. It's Play-Doh. <laughs> right? Not yet, it's... Oh, God. They're all salty. We also have these fans circulate the air, and as always, our Panasonic microwave. Whoopee. Whoopee! Whoopee! There's no echo in her cavern <laughs> here. In goes the Play DoGiorno pizza. Oh, yeah. Including mm. the ABC part as well. Yeah. Because mm. everyone loves ABC. ABC. How long I should put it in there for? Uh, oh, regular brick oven pizza's probably in there for about five minutes, so put it in there for three. Five minutes? <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and put it in there for four minutes. That's even better. I know. How's that, uh, that Gatorade? Mm. Wash you know that Play-Doh down? You know what yeah. that Gatorade is, right? It's urine. Oh, um, dude, you just keep nailing them tonight with these trick food items. It's my urine. <laughs> it has electrolytes, though, so I mean... Anything is better than Play-Doh. <laughs> really? You want to try my brownies? <laughs> <laughs> From the taste of it, I can only guarantee the smell will be even greater. Mm, yeah. <laughs> Just because you can't see inside the microwave means we can't either. <laughs> <laughs> now we here at Is It A Good Idea To Microwave This try our very hardest to keep the microwave clean for each and every experiment. But sometimes, it's just damned impossible to see inside that dark bitch sometimes. Yeah. You better watch your mouth there, son. F*** you. <laughs> I mean, when it steams up, there's really nothing we can do. There's nothing we can do. I'm guessing microwave. this is going to be like the one experiment that doesn't catch fire. No, it'll find a way. Whoopi's resourceful. I have pizza's bacon, dude. I ordered a Hawaiian. They said it would be there in four minutes or less. Where is it? Three, Three one, two, done. Masks on, because this is going to suck. Oh, that's a fun smell. Is that what it tasted like? Open her up. What? <laughs> no smoke? Unpossible. Oh, there's the smoke. Well, guys. Oh, it actually has a tough crust. Wow, it, it actually kind of like baked it like a big cookie. Oh, and that's that crunchy exterior, and I'm guessing, yes, soft interior. And really hot, too, actually. That was a bad idea. So you may be wondering, <laughs> is it a good idea to microwave your Play-Doh creations in the microwave? Absolutely! I thought it was a pretty cool result. Mm. I mean, if you, if you make something and you want to save it for all time, and you don't have, like, an actual furnace, use your microwave. It'll it's like a kiln. It. It's a kiln for lazy people. <laughs> And that's about it for Is It A Good Idea To Microwave This? I'm your host, Jory Karen. So you may be wondering, is it a good idea to microwave your microwave creations in Play-Doh? What? How did you manage that? Alright, ready? It's gonna be gross, dude. I don't envy you right now. That's a good point. You've done it before. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'll just... Ready? Yeah. Let's find out.